Hey there, everybody. Welcome back. Uh, this is ne Let's Play Neverwinter Nights 2 Blind with me, DJ Numa. We're in a conversation. Nishki just said he'll be ready, though, since he knows I'm here. He's got to know I'll be coming for him. And let's see. After the trouble he's caused us, I'm all for killing him. Slowly. Oh. Oh. But I, I want to kill him. <laughs> Go on. I see. <laughs> and that is how to do it. And, but it'd be easier just to kill him. Yes, it is. No, torture. Fine. Huh. You've got a point, so let's kill him. <sighs> Enough. Yes. Or maybe they don't like you. Calm down, Nishka. Hmm. Hmm. Fine, I'll trust you on this. We'll do it your way. I still want to kill him. When did you tell me that? Huh? When did you tell me that? When that guard walked past the other time? <sighs> Do you know where we can find Leldon? A little? Maybe she can get me in. Who's a fella? Hmm. So it was a public urinal? A public bath. I like torture, but I like torture. God damn it, Nishka. Uh, loot that. Go to Eleni. Loot that. Eh, eh.
Okay, go, go, no, no, go there. Loot that. Alright. Now, everybody rest. I believe that we may have found a slight answer to our frame rate problem, everybody, using the camera that I hate. Of course. So, where were we going? Oh yeah, let's let's go do Kelgar's thing. Isn't isn't that temple in here somewhere? Wasn't didn't it say it was? Yes, it's over there. That way. So we go here, do Kelgar's thing, end the episode, I work on it, and everybody's happy. To the Temple of Tear! Away! What do these guys do? Let's talk to him. The sunken flagon's the best tavern in well thank you! Want treat cheap drinks and food? Get it out the sunken flag and check out the sunken flag. The Moonstone Mask is a great place to relax if you've got the coin. To the door. Away. And then I need to sell all the crap that I just picked up because I have a strange feeling that I'm getting over encumbered. Say really saved often. That is a good tip. And so I will save. Go here. Oh god, the frame rate. How did you get hurt? Welcome. You seek an audience? By the nine hells we do. I'm looking to sign up. You wish to join the Disciples of Tear? If that's what you call those skinny twigs who threw me out the window of the dragon's talon, then yes. Fight? You're in a fight with the Disciples of Tear? It's odd that any of the even-handed would seek out battle. Like most of our faith, they, do, they usually only respond when provoked and are rarely violent. And rarely violently. Eh, uh, well, I may have stirred things up a bit. Just a little. But that fight taught me some things, and I want to learn more. About our faith? No, no, no. Fighting's the only religion for me. I want to learn to fight like them, and how they were able to beat me so easily. If you were defeated, such a defeat must just have, must have, that must have been just. Tear teaches us this. Your loss will, was meant to reveal a truth. Truth? The truth is that they beat me. Like a half-clan, uh, there, half-clan whelp. And I want to know how they did it. If you seek to learn all from your loss, then you must discover why you were so easily defeated. I don't think you're hearing the words coming out of my mouth. That's why I'm here. To learn. But we cannot help you. Is that so? Well, maybe I'll help clean the floors here in here with your face. Will that change your mind? Be silent, Kelgar. Let the priest speak. Tyr puts all who come to him for help on trial. He judges who is worthy and who is not. Alright, sounds fair to me. Tyr wants bears fighting for him, not mewling little cubs. So what is this trial? Burning coals? Drinking contest? What? The <laughs> drinking contest. The path of Tyr is that of the maimed, the even-handed, and the just. So are the trials. Can you tell me about the trials? The trial of the maimed requires that the petitioner face those who he has wounded, usually those of his bloodline or clan. Humph. Never turned a blade against my clan, I haven't. I knew If I knew where some of them were, you could even ask them. Only when one understands how their actions may hurt another, inadvertently or not, can he truly understand himself. The trial of the even-handed is the one that interests me. The trial of the even-handed requires that the petitioner learn to see all around him in an equal light, without the trappings of prejudice. 
Prejudice? I'm not prejudiced by the nine hells. I even travel with a backstabbing tiefling, and of all, th of all, with a backstabbing tiefling of all things. And you know how her kind are. Without such perspective, there can be no justice. For you have passed judgment before you even know those around you. But how can one be made be made to see? Often, the best way to learn through is to learn through those one travels with. Oh, sorry. When a petitioner understands someone he travels with, then he will learn to see fairly the others he meets for the first time. Okay. I am interested in learning about the trial of justice. To fight is not enough. To fight with a cause, that is where the strength lies. When you fight for a higher purpose, something beyond the self, you will find that you gain the strength for your actions and it are become impossible to defeat. Alright, we've heard enough of these trials. Agreed. Now where do I go to meet these tests? I cannot answer that for you. Each petitioner is challenged depending on their own path, not at a moment of our choosing. All I know is that you have not yet faced these trials. They are yet to come. This is ridiculous. I've heard enough. Cast out a dwarf, will you? Who needs you? Very well, then you, when you have faced the trials, seek me out, Kelgar of the Clan Iron Fist. I had questions for you. I could use some healing. Alright, now that that's done and over with. This has been Let's Play Neverwinter Nights 2 with me, your host, DJ Numa. Catch you next time, everybody. Bye.